Bring a little sunshine in my life. Bring a little sunshine in my life. Bring a little sunshine in my life. Hey, I'm Miss Sunshine, and today I'm talking to Holly Williams. Wedding on June is one of my favorite songs of yours. Can you tell me about that one? Sure. Thank you so much. I wrote it about my mama's parents.、Um, being from the lineage of Hank Williams Jr. and Sr., so many people focus on the Williams side. And unfortunately, I never knew my grandfather, Hank Williams. He died in 1952. So I grew up with my mom's parents. They were named Warren and June White. They lived in a little cotton farm in Louisiana. We were together for 56 years and. Had four babies, and I lost both of them before this record. So I wrote this kind of from my grandpa's shoes to my grandma. So how has your family influenced your music? I am the most influenced,、uh, more than anything, by their ambition and their entrepreneur kind of personalities.、Um, my grandfather and dad are obviously both very talented, but they seem to keep fighting for what they wanted. When Hank Williams came out, not many people were doing the kind of music he was doing. And at 13 years old, he went to a little radio station in Alabama and begged them to let him on the radio. And and then you know he became huge. And my dad, when he started, people were wanting him to sing his dad's songs, and he fought against crowds that were not wanting him to do his own thing. And he just kept pushing and pushing. So it's really inspiring to me of how they just set their own path. Well,、um, what's the first music you remember listening to? In the very beginning,、um, people think that I was around music a lot with my dad, but we actually were a little more shielded from it. So, I really got into songwriters like Bob Dylan and Neil Young,、um, Jackson Brown,、um, and then from the country side, it would have been Dolly Parton, Merle Haggard, my dad and grandpa,、uh, Willie Nelson, Chris Christopherson, all that kind of early '70s songwriter stuff. I loved. That's awesome. Tell me about the first time you played. Were you nervous? I was very nervous. It was at the Bluebird Cafe here in Nashville. I went on a Monday Night Riders night. I was 18 and stood in line and you know did the whole thing and got up for two songs and I thought I was going to drop my guitar. I was shaking and flipping out. I was a lot older than you were. The first time I picked up a guitar, I was really nervous. It took me a, quite a bit of time to、uh, get comfortable on stage. So I'm finally there, but、um, you know we had some growing pains. Well, what's your favorite breakfast on the road? Favorite breakfast on the road? I would say that、um, Cracker Barrel would have to be our guilty pleasure while we're on tour. The sausage biscuits and gravy with the cheese grits is what I eat if I do not have an interview for a very long time. Well, I love your album, The Highway. Have you got anything new in the works? Yes, ma'am. I'm starting a new record in August. I'm working with a producer I love named Dave Cobb, who's done artists like Jason Isbell and other records that I love. And it'll probably come out early next year, and then we'll be.、Uh, Doing shows, hitting the road, so I'm writing for it right now. That's awesome. Well, would you sing one of your grandfather's songs with me? Sure, I would love to.、Um, I think I'll do one of my favorites、uh, called "I Saw the Light." I've been singing this one a lot at shows. Here we go. I wonder so aimless, and I feel wasting. I would. Wandering straight, but straight. 